We happen to be in government in a coalition. Pam, however, is the oldest party in this coalition, the strongest party in this coalition, and of course contributes to all of the major decisions of the government that benefit the people in our country. And when you hear about an increase in salary for civil servants, you know that we were all in cabinet when the cabinet of your government made that decision. While we are here in constituency four tonight, you would have elected, as you just heard, a champion of a man in Lindsay Fitzpatrick Grant. The Virtuals High School has benefited from $30 million from the CDB in terms of building out and upgrading the TVET centers. And when I say TVET, I mean the home economic centers. And something good is happening in constituency number four. Members, friends, supporters, I want to tell you tonight the kind of things I did do. So I started a breakfast program. The program has been so good that they reached out to me from the Virtuous High School and said they wanted me to do it at the Virtuous High School. The young people through me have started a HARP program, H-A-R-P, a homework and reading program. When the number got to 60, Mandy told me, Mandy said, Master, tell me, Mr. Grant, we can't go no more. 60. We only have 16 volunteers to do, deal with 60 people, so we had to cut it. You understand representation in this constituency? Grant again! And today we are happy because the best representation that you have ever received in this constituency has been from none other than Lindsay Fitzpatrick Grant. The People's Action Movement has been a champion of unity throughout the history of this country. We have been at the vanguard of every major push, every major development in this country. The time has come for me to say again to all of those who have strayed from the People's Action Movement to come back home. St. Kitts and Nevis doesn't belong to any one individual. It belongs to all of us. The future that we dream of cannot be achieved without the essential element of trust. We shall not resign ourselves to a fatalistic opinion of keeping the status quo. It cannot be business as usual. When better can be done, when better can be done and when real unity is needed we must be prepared to preserve that real unity and to earn that real unity we can work honestly and earnestly with each other if we trust each other when real unity is needed we must be prepared to preserve that real unity and to earn that real unity I believe that we got the strongest part of this unity, which is four. So if we got the strongest part, we're supposed to be able enough to say, well, you got the O, but we got the four.